Across the bridge. On Indian Road coming back this way? Yeah, yeah. It's on the Indian Road. You heard it laugh. Yeah, yeah. You know how you got that little creek down there? Yeah. You heard it laugh. Huh. And we were all in the back of my grandpa's uh, pickup, me, my two brothers, and about three of our buddies. And me and my two buddies were sitting against the tailgate. And as soon as we heard that, and we all looked at each other, we shot to the bid, the bid of the truck. Yeah, and we were asking each other, just like, I know you heard that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Came with my dad? yeah. And then another time, <laughs> me and my grandpa was going to Indodarko, and um, we were uh, we got back to that same spot, and there was a little clown doll sitting right, sitting upright in the middle of the road. Oh, <laughs> and we pulled over, we pulled over, and he was like, Shh. I was like, shall I move it? He was like, no, don't move it. He said, we're just going to pray right now. Yeah, so we yeah. pulled over. Yeah. He said, don't even bother. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. the best thing you always pray. Yeah. Yeah, what time my dad? He said, you bother something. Oh, ho. Oh. <laughs> What's your clown story, Frank? Yeah. Uh, really? Over here, my no, bell tongues. There was a, a, you know, they, all these, they, they, a long time ago, they had these stores with gas stations. They're, they're, they're like in the country, different places. Uh -huh. A long time ago, like in the 30s. And, 40s. Uh, and they had a carnival. Uh, uh, the stretch spot, the, the, the engines were playing baseball, especially on Sunday. Sunday afternoon, they'd all gather to play uh, baseball. And uh, anyway, they had a carnival over there. Some people said there was a, a, a railroad in a truck, and they crashed. And that's where it died. Huh. But uh, after the, uh, it came in over there by uh, Fort Cobb on the railroad track. You know, the, the carnival they all traveled by railroad at that time. Yeah. And uh, they came in, they had to, uh, the carnival, whatever, you know, and it's the last night, and I guess they partied, or they, you know, they, they drank. And he wasn't a good person. He was kind of, the people didn't like him. His own people, you know, the carnival people. And I guess he got drunk, and he got drunk in the, the weeds, and they just left him. And it had rain that night. And I guess he caught pneumonia, or he got sick, real sick. And when he woke up, the carnival was gone, and there was nobody there. And he tried to go to these farmhouses to get help. And no one could help him, none of the people. Because he still had his hand. He hat. still does, and says he still dressed like a clown? He still dressed as a clown. <laughs> and he came all the way. You know where Cedar Creek is? That corner right there? Up there on top was an old Indian uh, farm called the Witzeland Farm. And he barely, he made it to that part of the farm and he died in that barn. That's what a lot of the old Indians tell me. He died in that barn. So now, on that Indian road, sometimes you'll see a hitch, he'll be hitchhiking. You go up again, he'll be hitchhiking again. You go up again, he'll be hitchhiking again. And then, like these farmers, if they're flying, night flowering or something, and then they'll come by and do little tricks in front of their, uh, their uh, lights. <laughs> and then, too, he'll bother some of the uh, Indian families, like the creeper bears. One night, I guess the, all the grandkids were there, and my grandma was at a powwow or something, you know, she was gone. And he was, he, he was knocking on the door, he was looking in the, 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 the windows, and just freaked the kids out. So the parents came. Once they came, then I guess he took off. Uh -huh. But they see him, and they'll see him hitchhiking on the road. A family seen him on that uh, boat on road. Going that way. Yeah. He was hitchhiking. Three o'clock. Yeah. And then when, when they went by him, he jumped on his car. Uh, her name is Elaine. I don't know if you. Uh, her name is Elaine Luhan. And uh, her kids were young. I don't know if you know Joe. Remember Joe? Joe Lunhoff. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Fought fire with him. Yeah, yeah. He was little, and he said that thing, that clown jumped on their car. Uh, and they were trying to go, and they were trying to, uh, you know, uh, go fast to try to throw it off. And it did. Finally, they went to that corner that comes to my house. Over there, the, the, it was an old place where they had a camp meeting. They had prayer meetings. And it, it was the Lujans. They were their kin to that family. And uh, anyway, that's where it, uh, it finally jumped off. Oh, wow. So this clown thing is in Carnegie? Yes, right here in this area. So. Did you see Chris? Come on, my boy.
That's crazy. Yeah. He lives way everything. All right. Well, we'll get along with. Does he want to carry a cross? I don't know. He weighs 380 pounds. He don't look 380 no more. Right on. That's a 100-pound loss. That's what I'm trying to do. But I'm not doing a good job at that part. He's <laughs> stolen 250 by Christmas. Right on. He'll do it. Is, and then my granddaughter. Is he up there now? Huh? Is he up there now? Yeah. Right. Anyways, uh, uh, guy, a guy was getting ready to do uh, stand. What you got? Clear south, and he caught the, the clown. Can you see it? It's right around that circle. Uh, see the see nose? Can I can see, see it now. It's kind of hard. It's, it's in the bushes. Yeah, it's right. in the bushes. That's, that's crazy. Wow. Yeah, he was uh, getting his, uh, his uh, uh, stand for deer season. He's getting it ready. It's kind of hard to tell, so yeah, now you, you can, can see it. You can see that nose. You can see that uh, nose. All right. So, cut this video. My partner's a couple of stories. I'm more into videos and typing it all out. Just because it takes a long time as well. Mm -hmm. There's a couple stories, man. There's some things going on right here in Carnegie. <laughs> all right. But what we do is pray so they all go away.